Some accessories I recommend for this rifle are displayed in front of you. The first one would be the Remington Tactical Scope Base. Zero MOA, it comes with the screws and a little bit to install them. Okay. We have the scope rings. We have the Vortex scope rings, 30 millimeter. High rings with six screws per ring, so 12 screws in total. We have a quality US made muzzle brake for 308 caliber. We have a 10 round single stack mag made by Magpul. It's a P mag. The AR-10 mags will not work, so you have to make sure that you get the proper single stack. We have some Federal ammo. I also have some Winchester and I'll be doing some custom loads. And of course, the most important accessory, and the last but not least, is the Vortex Crossfire 2 6-24mm rifle scope. Now let's take a look at some of the tools I recommend for installing the scope and getting a rifle ready for action. First thing would be the blue Loctite 242. That's just for your little screws and everything so they don't come loose as you're shooting from the impact. A nice kit with proper bits so you don't mess up anything. This is a really inexpensive kit. It was about $11 on Amazon. It comes with 51 pieces and bits specifically made for working on firearms. As you can see, it has screwdriver bits, torx bits, all sorts of different bits. Really nice kit for $11. I most definitely recommend a scope leveling kit, such as this Wheeler Professional Radical Leveling Kit. And I'll show you how to install the scope using all these tools in the next video. So be sure to stay tuned, hit like and subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you can check out the new video. And the last tool that I really recommend is a Wheeler torque wrench. That way you can properly set the torque on all the screws and don't break any and don't over torque any and ruin your scope. The scope actually recommends around 18 inch pounds. So this tool will help you make sure that all that is within spec.